All right, what I'd like to do is show you guys how to find the x and y intercept from an equation, 2x minus 5y equals 1. Now, when given a, a graph, it's very easy to remember what the y and x intercept are. Because we know that the point where it crosses the y um, axis, that's your y intercept. Okay, and we know that it's going to be at some point 0, comma y. And our x intercept is where it crosses the x axis. And that is at some point x comma zero. That's what we call the x intercept. <laughs> so it's very easy to remember on a graph, oh, it's where it crosses each axis. However, we come into the problem when we start dealing with the equation because here I don't know what this graph looks like. Now we are going to learn later how to graph this equation, but there's a very simple way we can also do this algebraically that will help us find the x and y intercepts and then also learn how to graph it later. So the one key important thing that I, want to, that I want to take from this graph is we notice that when the y-intercept, at the y-intercept, x is 0. And at the x-intercept, our y-value is 0. Because remember, a coordinate point is x comma y. So here, x equals 0. And at the x-intercept, y equals 0. So I'm going to go ahead and erase this and then write those two different um, properties. So at the y-intercept, <coughs> x is equal to 0, and at the x-intercept, y is equal to 0. Okay? So what does it mean when one value is equal to 0? Well, what we can do is we can treat this as a function, and if we say 0, x is now equal to 0, I'm going to now evaluate this for when x is equal to 0. So I'm going to plug in 2 times 0 minus 5 times y equals 1. And then over here, I'm going to say 2x minus 5 times 0 equals 1. So now, looking at these two equations, now what I'm going to do is for this one, I'm going to solve for my variable y. And for this problem, I'm going to solve for my variable x. So I know that anything multiplied by 0 is 0. So I'm just going to kind of cancel them out. So therefore, I'm left with negative 5y equals 1. And over here, we have 2x equals 1. So now, we're just going to go ahead and simply go ahead and use our uh, division, pro division property of equality. And since my negative 5 is multiplied by my y, I'm going to divide by negative 5 on both sides. And here, I'm going to divide by 2 on both sides. Therefore, x equals 1 half. And here, y equals a negative 1 fifth. So, when go ahead and graphing my two points, if I know that here's my y-intercept, I know that x is 0 and my y-value is negative 1 fifth. My point is 0, negative 1 fifth. And my point here is going to be 1 half, 0. So I can go ahead and plot these two points, and they would be the two intercepts on my equation. All right, so that's how you find the x and y-intercept um, from an equation.